All right, guys, we are on site. Welcome to today's video. Thank you for tuning in. And of course, we got some assemblies today. We're still in back to school season, and so the assemblies are rolling in. And today we have a student from Harvard, I believe. And he's got a simple computer desk that is from Wayfair. Nothing that we can't handle. Anyway, it should be a basic assembly. I'm just gonna grab my normal tools, safety gear. I got my gloves in my pocket. I got my shoe covers in my pocket. I got my mask in my pocket. It should be on my face. And I'm parked a little bit far from where I'm going. So that's why I'm like double checking and triple checking, making sure I have everything because I definitely don't wanna have to come back here. I'm in Cambridge right now, which is basically Boston, but right outside of Boston. And um, oh my goodness, parking here is the absolute worst. You know who I gotta pay first though. The city, gotta get their dollars for me parking. But it is what it is, it's part of the game. Let's head over. Man, this freaking tool bag gets heavy once you start putting cleaning supplies and all that stuff in it because of COVID. So we wanna wipe down the surfaces anytime we finish an assembly. Now this COVID-19 that we're in is gonna definitely make us change our habits. So when I checked my text messages as soon as I parked, the customer actually had let me know. They were like, hey, we got some, might have some other furniture that we need to have assembled. So it may be just more than a desk. Hopefully it's more than a desk. Hopefully it's not. It's a catch-22 because if there's not an extra desk, I get to go home. If there is an extra desk, I make more money. It's a cool Thursday. The Celtics play. Oh, by the way, they won game two. So now we're up 2-0. But I think I'm pulling up to 73, 76. Yeah, this is 73 right here. All right, guys, I'm pulling up. So let me put my mask on and uh, give the customer a call.
Ew. Rain, rain, go away. Please come back another day. Well, I hope you guys are enjoying the, uh, the assembly. Had to take a quick timeout break to go move my car because I think you only get like two hours or something like that, hour and a half. And, um, you know, the electronic meter that I paid is running out in about three or so minutes. So I got to move my car to a different zone, which sucks because I was in a zone. <laughs> you like that? No, nah, I was in a zone with the assembly, just kind of flying through it. But um, nothing I haven't seen before. The directions are actually pretty good. When I saw the uh, website link prior to coming here, I had questioned whether or not the instruction manual uh, was going to be good, but it seems to be you know, pretty good. But let me ask you guys something, whether you're an assembler or you know someone who doesn't really do that for a living, what is your least favorite item to put together? Like the one where you're just like, oh, you just dread having to do it. For me personally, it's dressers. Um, not that they're hard, but sometimes they come in a gazillion pieces. Well, most of the time they do, not all the time. But when they do, it's just like, ah. Oh. It's not even that it's hard, it's just tedious, a lot more pieces. And the more drawers that are inside, uh, the worse it gets. So sometimes you have a six drawer dresser or eight drawer dresser, you're just like, oh my goodness. But it's not hard, but kind of a pain. I wonder if I could just uh, move my car across the street. What zone am I in? 2521. So I have to park somewhere where it's not zone 2521. So let's see. You know what I'm gonna do actually? Before I hop in my car, I'm gonna go across the street and see if that's a different zone. Let me run across the street. <sighs> Cars are coming. Oh no, 2521. All right, so I've got to drive down the street or do a little something different because I'm going to get a ticket if I stay here. All I want to do is assemble. Not today. All right, here we go. 2521. Is this the zone? This is safe. No, 2521 still. Ay, 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 ay. Let's see if I'm going to get a break here. Zone 25T23. Bingo. 2523. There you go. I just want to get back to my assemblies. I don't care where I park at this point. All right, two, five, two, three. All right, probably need like another half hour. So let me get and punch that in my phone. Anyway, back to our conversation. What's your least favorite item to assemble? Like I said, mine are dressers. The thing with dressers is as soon as you, you know, put it together. What's up, man? Good, you? So the thing is with dressers, once you are in the flow and you get to the actual drawer parts, it's pretty much the same, repetitive, but the same. So at least mentally you're like, okay, I'm down the final stretch. Now put that in your comments. What, what's your least favorite item to assemble, whether you're a professional or not? Now, what's your favorite item to assemble, right? If we're talking furniture, I don't know. They're all kind of the same to me. You know, beds, particularly the platform beds that take like 30 minutes to put together, 20 minutes on a really, really good day and ellipticals ellipticals, exercise bikes, and treadmills. I love putting together um, exercise equipment, especially uh, exercise bikes. One, they're really, really easy. Two, I like testing them out. Hey guys, I'm walking back in right now. I've got about 45 minutes on the meter. So let's see if I can beat that time. Desk assembly done, happy customer. I was trying to be quiet in there because uh, like I said, she's a student and uh, there's a lot of virtual classes going on right now. All in all, pretty simple assembly. 
Um, I had to extend my <laughs> my parking meter by another 12 minutes, so I guess I'm not as fast as I think I am. I'm the fastest assembly you'll ever meet. I bet you you don't know anybody who's done more assemblies than I have. Thousands at this point. I'm proud of it. My uh, next appointment, I actually canceled. Asked to postpone the assembly to sometime later this week. Also a college student. But anyway, hope you guys are enjoying these videos. Make sure to subscribe to this channel. But if there's anything that you'd like to see me do in these videos that have to do with assemblies, let me know. If you guys got any questions on how to put stuff together, if you guys like better angles, different style of videos, do you like the vlogs, do you like the time-lapse videos, let me know because essentially I'm creating this content for you guys. So I would love you guys' input. But for now, I'll see you guys on our next video. Peace.